What's up, Wayne Baron here with darkfix.net and uh, as you can tell by the video that we just got from the store on the unboxing, we have a new hard drive to go inside of our laptop, which is right here. It's a one terabyte drive, so we're going to swap out the 500 gig that is sitting inside the laptop now with the one terabyte to give us some more space. So let's go ahead and get that done. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get everything unplugged. Get this mic to where it's doing what it's supposed to do so yep get everything unplugged from our laptop unplug our power set these to the side flip it over okay the first thing that we always want to do uh, also this is a Lenovo G770 but we always want to remove the battery so sliding this over to where you see the red, and then moving this to the left, slides the battery out. This way you do not get any extra jolts or anything, especially if the screwdriver or anything touches any of the electronics inside the laptop. With the battery being out, you don't have to worry about frying your board. So uh, that happened to my father. He fried his board on one of his laptops. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six screws. Grab right here. Sort of wiggle it just a little bit. Okay. And then put this over on the side. We got two screws right here. Grab a hold of that screw, set it aside. And then this screw set it aside. Simply take your finger and push. And then that unhooks the drive from the motherboard. Now let's come over here. Alright, we've got one, two, three, four screws here. So let's go ahead and unscrew them. Okay, now let's just remove the drive. All right, there it goes. <laughs> I was trying to take it off wrong. But this right here is the original drive. And uh, let's go ahead and set that aside. And then let's go ahead and take out our new drive. And uh, so, yep, everything looks good. So let's set this. Make sure that you put it on right. Want to make sure that goes to that side. And then slide this over, like so. Now let's put the screws back in. So now, let's simply take this, slide it right there, push it in. Take our two screws. And that's the reason why you have it cut off, because of stuff like that. So let's try that one more time. Take the screw, put it right in there. Oops, didn't mean to hit the tripod just then. Take that screw, slide it in right there. Okay. Now, if you need to replace your memory, that's done right here. Um, it's really simple. Just pull it out to the side. Try that again. That right there, and then you just slide the memory out and do the same thing with that one. Slide it back in like so. Now, if you got a, um, if you got two different size memories, so you got a a 4 gig and a 2 gig, your 4 gig would go on bottom, your 2 gig would go on top. You never put the uh, lower uh, size on bottom because it needs to have the higher size on bottom. So the higher size goes here and the lower size goes on top. I've got 4 and 4 right there for 8 gigs. So now let's go ahead and get our cover put back on. That is good. Now let's grab a hold of our 
battery pack, slide it back in, move that over to the side, and now we should be able to launch the system and let's go ahead and set the camera up so the camera can actually see it. Let's go check out our hard drive. Hit F2, enter setup. And uh, we got eight gigs of memory sitting inside of here. So let's go ahead and jump over. That right there is our hard drive. So we are going to go ahead and uh, get this thing set up and we're going to install the new operating system. So thanks for watching. Y'all have a good one and bye bye.